Hello. Hopefully this one will record properly because the last one I did didn't. Uh, this is Dino Storm and if you have ever thought to yourself what the Wild West really needed was dinosaurs and laser cannons, this is absolutely the game for you because look at this. Oops, no I didn't mean to move. There we go. Look at me, I have a skinny green dinosaur and a laser cannon and some fancy fancy boots. So I am going to remember how to move the camera and then I am going to trundle on over here. So yeah, somebody somewhere thought you know, the Wild West is a, is a great thing. It would be a great theme for a, a computer game. Look at that. Carcasses just hanging there. They're going to get flies on them. So, uh, talk to this lady. This is Hope Simmons. She has a really big dinosaur, and I think that's bragging. Uh, there we go. Nice to meet you. You were close to Dinoville now. The story is that there is a gold rush in Dinoville, so you have to go there and get the gold. But first, I am going to give my dinosaur a drink. The reason there are dinosaurs is not yet explained. I'm sure there's a reason. Uh, I can't dismount my dinosaur, apparently. Oh, I'll get my reward. So, my reward for this is... Experience points. And they all zoom up there. Yay! Uh, you're almost there. You're talking very loudly, Hope Simmons, because I've already left you in the dust. Dan Wright, give him my regards. Okay. So this is Dan Wright. And he has got a massive dinosaur. How can, that, that's not fair. Look at my skinny little green dinosaur. Alright. Oh, okay. Oh. Sorry, it just... I keep expecting the quest things to pop up and say, Look, you've completed this quest. But no, I have to do clicking. And I've just fireworks right up that dinosaur. Congratulations. I've got a hundred fame. I don't know what fame does. Before I tell you how to reach Dinoville, could you please assist me with this Entelodian problem I'm having? They keep ransacking my shack and my mining equipment is quite sensitive. I have to attack Entelodians. Which I'm guessing are over here because of all the blue footprints. Oh look, they're so cute. Very clicky. There we go. So there's two kind of um, weird things about this game. Um, for the setting, to get to Dinoville, okay. Finish that, get reward. For the setting, you know, your dinosaurs are not exactly what I would think of as the first thing. And then I would think, well... I don't know what that quest is. Read more. Find out. Thank you for helping out with my Interludian problem. To get to Dinoville, you just have to keep following the road. You will need to fight the Brontops. Ooh. Um, yeah, so it's kind of... It's random. Which is no bad thing. Uh, I'm just going to toodle up here. Toodly, 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 too. I can't jump. Which is annoying because I want to do that noob thing where you jump around. Jumpy, jumpy, jumpy. Oh no, look. They've got little faces on them and they're spotty. Oh. Well, time to die. And this one too. I have a special. Oh, I see. I have a special dinosaur attack. Dinosaur attack. Yeah. I don't seem to have any loot. What does that button do? Hey, that's auto attack. And that one did pop up. All right. 
Thanks for clearing the road. Now here is just one last obstacle to master. Bandits are a bit further down the road. Poor Tom Wolf was mugged just this morning. Collect the belts. Follow the blue footprints. Walk into a cactus. I see what you're doing there. Okay. So, so the bandits are quite handily just all clustered around in a big pile. So that's quite good. That saves on travel time. A bandit belt. A bandit belt. Oh, we have to click the loot. What do they think I am? A person who owns a mouse? I like that they're all together. It's like they're having a barbecue. They're just getting together, they're having a social time. And none of the ones that I'm not attacking are worried about the ones that I am attacking. So these, you know, these guys are very much in it. You know, every man for themselves. You know, this guy here just watched me kill his, his friend. But, yeah, whatever. Whatever. That's my rewards for the Brom Tops, which I forgot to collect. Hey, look at this. I want one of them. Look at that. Stand still while I film you. All the way up there. All the way up there. Dinosaurs are pretty cool. So I'm going to give Tommy's band belts. Thank you so much. Visit Carl Nelson. You know, I just got here and you're all making me do stuff for you. That's fine. I'm now leaving Dinoville Canyon. I don't want to. I'm in Dinoville. And I'm pleased to find that it is a safe area with no PvP allowed. Because as you may, if you watched my Transformers video last week, you'll know that I suck at PvP. I try and click all the buttons at once and everything is terrible. So, you know, if you ever see me in a game that allows PvP, I'm, I'm a good bet to attack. Chapter 2. Welcome to Dinoville. That's very kind of you. Lots of swoopy camera action here, that's good. There it is, right in front of you. Can I move on? I'm just going to skip. So, uh, take that. Another hundred fame. I'm going to leave... I won't sing it. But it's in your head now, isn't it? <laughs> I'm not following the blue... I'm a rebel. Are these guys bad? No. The Smilodons. Oh, they're also spotty. And I'm going to talk to this glowing blue person. Because what I have learned in life is that if someone is glowing blue, you should talk to them. Let me ask you something. Would you have thought that Ted Walters was such a gourmet? Would you be so kind as to guard Carla? Oh, I hate escort quests. <laughs> oh, I'm grumpy today. I'm so grumpy. Okay, so this is Carla over here, I'm guessing. And there's per another player with a great big dinosaur, and I'm here with my nothing dinosaur, but okay. Oh, I've already done that. Go away. I'm sorry, other player. There you are, trying to quest in his, you know, little Miss Newbie pants. Yeah, escort quests are the worst. Whoever came up with escort quests really just... You know, they can just stub their toe every day for the rest of their life on the corner of their desk, as far as I'm concerned. Oh, alright. Okay. I appear to be auto-moving, but alright. I'm running away. This is good This is good advice. When in doubt, flee. Well, I'm... Uh, there's a little thing that pops up when anybody ever... To start that again, but with English. There's a little thing that pops up whenever anybody does something. And the person who I'm walking beside, um, Vanio, is getting, <laughs> getting all the, uh, the quest texty things because uh, they're kind of amazing and I'm kind of stuck on my little green dinosaur. But alright. See, I can't even see if anything bad's coming. I'll zoom out. That'll help. There we go, look. Now, everything is tiny and of little consequence. 
So Van and Ho, if you're watching this, I'm sorry, I have a complete case of the suck. Okay, I'll kill that though. There we go, see? Pulling my weight, pulling my weight. Oh, where are we going? It's miles away. We're just going to stand around here for... Okay, here we go. Hey, look, I got my name up on the thingy thing. The thingy thingy. The little, um, the doofa doofa. 12%? Wow. This video is just going to be me doing an escort quest. At least I'm killing stuff now. Oh, 43%. That was a long canyon. I did not realise how long that canyon was. Maybe I dozed off. Was there a moment of silence then? The other thing about escort quests that is terrible is that the thing that you're escorting never moves at the same rate that you do. Um, if you've ever played World of Warcraft and the escort quests in there, if you walk, you're too slow. If you run, you're too fast. You have to keep stopping and starting. It's a nonsense. I never do them, unless there's a really good reward. So, not only is this Wild West dino filled, it's also got neon lights. I'm enjoying this as a theme. Kind of like a futuristic alternate universe Wild West um, thing. I ran out of words then, I don't know if you can tell. 59%, <laughs> there we go. I really think that if Carla's going to attract this many um, bitey things, then she needs to invest in her own weapons. You know, she can't just be relying on the kindness of strangers all the time. And if you could just stop standing around a bit, that would be cool. Okay, kill that. There we go. And I know you can't really see what's going on because it's all tiny, tiny, tiny. Um, I can't make the screen any bigger. I, I did. I did try earlier on a on a um, before I started recording because I thought that would be cool. Ninety one percent. This is very random. Because um, I thought it would be nicer if the screen was bigger so you could actually see what was going on, but it doesn't allow that. Why am I going over here? I'm going to go back over there. I didn't want to go over there. Bad weeds. Do not touch the bad weeds. They are bad. Oh, come on. Hustle it up, transporter. Hustle it up. Hustle it up. Hustle it up. Um, yeah, so I did try and make the screen bigger. I just said that. But I'm going to keep talking because this is a long quest. Uh, as we wander over here. This looks to be possibly a destination. Yes! So thank you, Van and Ho, for putting up with me. Get reward. I have really earned myself the rewards below. 33 dino dollars. Click to read the game guide. Welcome to Dinoville. Reach level 4, complete 3 quests, visit the dino store building. Dino store building. Sounds to me like the sort of place where they'd like me to spend real life money. So, um, let's go back the way we came. A little bit quicker this time. Let's go down here. Hey, look, screens and everything. This is cool. What does that do? I'm going to click it. I'm much the same in real life. What's that? I'm going to poke it. And that's how I lost my fingers. Combine items to receive a great new item with greater quality. Ooh, I don't have any items to combine, so I'll go over here. This is Charles Hawkins. He has nothing to say to me, which is good, because I never liked him. There's a glowing blue person. This is Peggy Warren. The simple delivery of mail has been Peggy's primary occupation for years. I've forgotten how to speak. She's easily the most literate person in Dinoville. I can tell by the hat. So in the mayor, a newsstand, editor in charge, offer help. I didn't really need the life stories. A bandit raid at the casino. Quick, get there before they rob all the money that was spent there. 
I'm going to go to the casino. Oops, I'm going to walk into a fence. I'm going to go around the fence and continue on my way. The casino is a fair way away. There's those things again. We saw them earlier. Where are my blue footprints? There's my blue... That's not a bandit. That's a bunch... Okay. Oh, this probably would be it. This... Is this it? No, that's a... Um, that's one of them. So I'm going to go this way instead. It's always good to start these games with someone who knows what they're doing. Here I go on my little dinosaur. I can't jump. I keep trying. I'm going to go around the cactus. Because I care about my dinosaur's feet. I just threw and caught my gun. I'm amazing. Well, around the cactus. I wonder how you upgrade. Because I would like a bigger dinosaur. This dinosaur's cute. Don't get me wrong. But cute uh, doesn't win it. How far away is the casino? How did she even know that there was a raid going on if the casino's on the other side of the planet? Oh, I see, there's the bandit. He's a rookie bandit, so I'm probably in with a good chance. Ooh, I've got a new thing, jump attack. Oh, I see, there's more of these guys. They're all over the place. I'm not even near the casino. Which is a shame, because I've got 33 dino dollars I'd like to throw into a machine and never get back. Let's see if you can guess my opinion on casinos. Now, here we go. I think I was just here. I meant to walk into that. I just wanted to see if it was solid. I have stopped moving. There we go. So if you think this video is going to end before I have caught all the bandits, you are very wrong. Because I want you to have closure on this storyline. I want you to be able to say those bandits were caught. I was just here. I swear I was just here. You know, I don't want you to be awake at night wondering what happened to the bandits. I don't want you to, to feel like, you know, like your favourite television show got cancelled next season. But that does mean that we might be here for the rest of the evening. Oh, that's good. It's a little bit closer. Those are the most awesome dinosaurs. Look how great they are. I feel bad I killed it. Okay. Do I want to look at... No. Okay. That's the daily login bonus, which is a little bit Facebooky. What I should do is Facebook games, because there's a lot of those, and I wouldn't have to, you know, pick a game so often. I said that like it's a hardship, like it's it's, <laughs> it's a burden on my life. Oh, I have to play a game. How terrible! Woe is me. I leveled up also, and. Where's my next? There we go. I like how I wave the gun around. I'm a gun waving lady. I couldn't remember what they called ladies in the Wild West. Ladies, probably. Yes, alright, I'll get my reward. Get reward. Thank you. Oh, no, I tried to preempt that. No, I'm not going that way. It's a little bit laggy. Oh, he's right there. Cool. Just right there, just right there, just next to that cactus would be great. 
Hey, I'm a skilled hunter. I kill on sight. You should know that about me. Oh, I've run out of blue footprints. Oh, the other way. Nope. Oh, what was that? <gasps> it's so exciting. Okay, he moved. Oh, can't jump. Stuck on a s tiny little slope. Here I go, here I go. These bandits really spread out, huh? Considering the last lot were all, you know, having their f annual picnic. These guys just, you know, they want to cover a lot of ground. But I'm going to hunt them down, because I am a great hunter. It just said that on the top of my screen. What's happening here? I don't understand. I'm just going to ignore it and move on. Oh, I see him. I see you, I see you. Stand still and let me kill you. One more, I think. Possibly two more. I can't remember how many I've killed. Okay, there we go. Oh, can't go down a cliff. That would be illogical in this game of dinosaurs and the Wild West. Let us not have any lack of logic in here. Having dinosaurs going down small slopes, it'd be madness, it'd be anarchy. It would be anarchy. It would be a world gone topsy-turvy. Oh, see, look, small slopes, can't do them. Tiny cliffs and steep bridges. Impossible for dinosaurs, which I think you will find is historically accurate. Because if you've ever watched Walking with Dinosaurs, they, they also were unable to do... Uh, little little cliffs and hills they never they never like going up hills then again neither does my dog that was a group quest and I did it all by myself you know go me and I am going to get my reward which is 56 dino dollars and some fame and I am gonna leave that here so oh no I didn't mean to do that I meant to turn around like that so you'd see me and go, ooh, amazing. Look how scary. I'm going to do it in front of the hotel. Oh, picturesque. There we go. So that is Dino Storm, the least logical game I have ever played. Well, actually, not quite, because there's, um, you know, the superhero one I did the other week. But apart from that, anyway, I'm going to shut up now and I will see you next week.